from the testimony, I find probable cause on all cases of lying over to the grand jury. For 10 years, Gloria Dumas has been a General Sessions judge with responsibilities that include issues affecting Nashville's neighborhoods. You are by law the environmental judge. Except by statute, yes. So that's your job? Correct. The citation is 91942, noise ordinance violation. But stop by the environmental court on Wednesday afternoons and you won't find the environmental judge anywhere. Well, you can appeal my ruling to Judge Dumas. Instead, you'll find a private attorney who gets paid by taxpayers to hear Dumas's cases for her. She says it's because she can't share the everyday workload with the 10 other judges and hear environmental cases on top of that. If we can figure out a way to, so that I can set my own schedule instead of 10 others setting my schedule, then you've got a different issue. I could do it. Still, when News Channel 5 investigates set up surveillance, we discovered how she really sets her own schedule. Often the last to arrive, sometimes the first to leave. I'm not going to tell you that I don't have issues with being late. I'm not going to tell you that I haven't all my life had issues with being late. It is something that I have problems with, always have had problems with. In fact, while she leaves everyday working folks waiting in her courtroom, we discover Dumas often doesn't leave her elegant Oak Hill home until well after she's supposed to be in court. Usually arriving at the courthouse at least 30 minutes late, taking another 30 minutes or more to get on the bench. Am I saying that's my big old flaw? Yeah, if you're looking for perfect, you need to throw me out because I'm not perfect. On this day, as Dumas leaves her neighborhood, it's 30 minutes after court was supposed to begin. By the time she's outside the courthouse, she's almost 45 minutes late. Still, she stops to talk on the phone. She talks and talks until finally she pulls into the garage almost an hour and a half late. If you have trouble having the discipline to be on time, mm -hmm. do you have the discipline to be a judge? I think I'm a very good judge. Even if you're chronically late? But late depends. You're saying that unless I'm sitting on the bench at 9 o'clock, I can't be an effective judge. I completely and totally 100% disagree with that. I got here at 7.15 this morning. So what about the day William Harris came to court for a suspended license? The line is here. Defendants accused of minor offenses are urged to show up as early as 7 to take care of their charges and get back to work. The judge's schedule lists the one-stop docket as 7.30 to 11. Nothing is available for the judge to do until 10 o'clock or after. But inside the courthouse, our hidden cameras find folks ready to go by 9. Almost an hour later, Dumas arrives but takes her time getting to the bench. 5 after 11 is when she showed up. If you come in on time, are there people you could go ahead and get out of there? I, it, I don't know. I don't think it's fair and I don't think it's right for them to come in whenever they want to and then we're having to pay their salary. Trespassing on railroad property. Which brings us back to Dumas's environmental court, at least what's supposed to be her court. So you're saying your schedule is so jam-packed you could not do this docket ever? I could do it at 5, 6, 7 o'clock at night. We spot the judge arriving just after 10 on one of her environmental court days. But just three and a half hours later, she's finished for the day. While taxpayers pay someone to hear her cases, we find her downtown entering a facility specializing in various beauty treatments. Later, before courts are even closed, she's picking up her dog from the kennel. So why didn't she head to environmental court to hear her own cases on a day when she obviously had time? For me to say, okay, well today I, I can go do this. You go home. I don't know, I don't understand why that would make sense. As to her frequent tardiness, and her reliance on someone else to hear her cases, Judge Dumas insists it says nothing about her work ethic. If this is to say that I'm a judge that doesn't work, I take great exception with that. 